Hey there folks, Mark Johnson, tech-snobs.com. Doing a full review on the Nokia Lumia 822. This is on Verizon. Um, very nice Windows phone device if you're familiar with the platform. A lot of nice things, we're gonna get into that. I just wanna start off first though. Um, when I was doing the unboxing, the SIM card tray I found out is actually underneath the tray where you could put a micro uh, SD card. And I believe this will take up to 64 gigs uh, a store. So yeah, you can just slide the card right in um, at the top. So yeah, that's definitely a good thing if you want to expand memory as it only comes with uh, 8 gigs. Um, while I'm booting this up, initial impressions is is very good. Um, I, like I said, I mean, there's some things I do notice about it that, that do set it apart from, uh, you know, some of the higher end Windows Phone devices. Obviously, you know, the screen... Uh, you know resolution and so forth. Um, it's not. It's 800 by 480. Um, it also. I want to say that I think the RAM is is that one gig. I have to double check that. But I mean the main thing, honestly, outside of the screen quality, is really like the main thing I notice a difference of. I mean obviously it's a plastic shell. The camera's still really good. You can do 1080p. I'm gonna uh, upload some uh, sample HD footage of that as well, so you can check that out. Um, but other than that, I mean, it, it's a very solid Windows Phone uh, performance, you know what I mean? Just like a lot of Windows Phones I've used. I mean, there's nothing um, here that, you know, that goes wrong with the expect, you know, that I can kind of really tell a major difference between this and other Windows Phones outside of the obvious, um, you know, the screen resolution. And one thing about, you know, with this one, we're going to kind of talk about some of the things that Verizon has done. Um, we're going to go into settings and then we're going to go to applications and then they enable this thing called data sense and data sense is pretty much as similar to what Android has where you can set uh, data limits uh, so you don't go over your data like I can set up a monthly limit and I could choose you know two gigs uh, let me see how that I don't know if I got to put in well yeah I guess it let me put in 20,000 so I'm assuming let me see monthly limit really didn't very interesting there I have to find out exactly how you have to type that in learn more and it goes to the web of course so it's data sense it does uh, debut here on the Windows phone uh, it looks like you could pin it to the screen too monthly you can enter the value so I'm not sure you have to put the how you put the value in I have to do some reading on that but long story short you it can do that which is a nice um, thing you can do on this phone another thing on here you know with uh, Verizon you also get the NFL mobile um, which is definitely pretty nice as well it does come preloaded on here you have NFL mobile of course my Verizon and then, really, honestly, you know, with this phone, a lot of it is basically, you know, from one Windows phone to another, it's basically in the App Store, the, the Nokia collection, whether you're using HTC, Samsung, they all have their own kind of specific apps. And by far, Nokia does the best job of giving you a, a great variety of, of all kinds of apps. I mean, as I'm just scrolling through here, they got their City Lens, their Maps. Um, they have their own version of Foursquare. It looks the same as the other one. The only difference I've noticed says Nokia Corporation, but nonetheless, it is there. And then you just have some other real nice, um, you know, Nokia trailers for movie trailers, panorama mode. Just very nice um, designed apps just for the, you know, for the Lumia series of phones. So, uh, great job by, you know, Nokia there. Camera is definitely nice. Um, 8 megapixel. Um, and, and you know, like a lot of Windows phones, you can just tap on the screen, and then it will focus in. So camera quality is definitely really good. Um, like I said, everything's real responsive. Um, and it's just a, a nice phone. I mean, it's forty nine ninety nine. I mean, you really can't beat the price on that. I did some speed tests. Let's see if I, let me get off of Wi Fi. Um, obviously, things aren't fast on LTE. They were, you know, say a year ago, as more people have gotten on it, but it's still very fast. Um, and it and is and it's a great feature. You also have a wallet mode on here. And another thing with Verizon's done on here, you also can get visual voicemail at no extra charge, which is a great thing. Um, because you know, still on a lot of their Android devices, you still have to uh pay for that. So that's definitely 
uh, one thing that's not. I actually didn't download the, the speed test, but I'll do that on my uh, other review with the HTC 8X. But another thing, last but not least, one of the standout apps I will say is the Nokia Music. And and the reason why I'm going to touch on Nokia Music is because you can actually make um, mixed radio stations and then you can save them for offline. And it's very, very nice. I mean, because if you don't want to pay for Xbox Music Pass, you can buy music on here too as well. But you can just make a mixed radio station. Like I can hit mixed radio. Um, they even have a Verizon exclusive. I can say best of 2012. And then there's best pop songs, hip hop. So if I click on best pop, if I hold on it, um, I can click on that. And then it will just start playing the music. And then another good thing about it is I can do a wave where I can um, save it offline. You know, it's really cool. So I could slide this up, make available offline, share it. I could pin mix to the start page. And uh, you get the best pop. So it's just a very, very nice feature you can use. Uh, you know, on this phone, you know, with the music. If you're in the music, it's definitely, Lumia has definitely did a, a great job with that. So definitely be sure to check that out. Um, be sure to check out the site. A lot of things coming up on tech-snobs.com. More reviews, phones, all kind of tablets, Surface Pro incoming. So thanks for watching, folks. Take care.